what's up guys you guys just saw me bring all this stuff out here and that's because we are going to continue to work on the van building the side speakers for it as you guys can see we have uh the table saw the jigsaw and then we have some wood here and i just got done doing the numbers and all the stuff that i need to cut and do just gonna get to work i can't wait to hear this thing sound and booming So you guys see, I just finished cutting all the pieces of wood. Now, I get to put everything together, like a puzzle. Yeah. This is that dummy wall. This is the one that's gonna make the airspace from being too big to being the perfect airspace for the speakers so we can get the best sound quality out of them. I just got done building these uh, boxes, right? It's all finished, they're both done. Next step is gonna be, we're gonna wrap it with the gray vinyl that we have here and the spray glue. And essentially, we are gonna do the exact same thing than we did to the sidewall first. We're gonna do the background in gray and the front with black suede. So I got the first one done and it looks pretty nice. So the first one's done. I haven't even started to cut this yet because actually this takes a while to put together. Uh, either or, it's gonna sound fantastic. It's gonna have four tweeters here, plus the two mids, four more tweeters over there and the two mids, three subwoofers, the two four by sevens in the front and two extra tweeters. This thing is gonna sound insane. Uh, so I'm gonna stop talking. I'm gonna get back to work. Finish the other speaker box so I can put it back in there. All right, well, I just got in and while I was gone, Ricky actually bumped out the six and a half enclosures for the rear. Looks like he tossed them in already and they fit pretty nice. So we've got a little bit of uh, more work that we're gonna build these in basically to the van, but uh, the enclosures are made. He went ahead and threw some vinyl on the front, which is super rad. Uh, and now I am gonna move on to getting this wall finished up. As you can see, I took the wood panel down that used to be there. We got our replacement material from SOS Customs. So I'm gonna go ahead and get some put on there now.
got our final panel up in the van with the upholstery on it, and now I'm just upholstering a um, inch and a quarter piece of metal to basically bridge the butt gap that's on the two panels so that we have a nice uh, upholstered piece with our Downstar hardware down the center. Just a nice little finisher panel. So throw some vinyl on that and we can toss it in. Ricky went ahead and knocked out some covers for our wheel wells. That's what they look like. And they're pink because that's the foam that we used to put under the vinyl that we're gonna be wrapping them with. So he went ahead and foamed them up for me so I can go ahead and put the vinyl on today. This is what it looked like before he made those. And so it basically accomplishes two things. It, it hides the wheel well a little bit and it fills that gap between the wheel well and the freezer. See how this fits after we added some material. Yeah, that doesn't look too bad, huh? It's nice against the, the gray floor. And once we put our uh, our molding in here, not bad. So right now we just got done cutting the L bracket that's gonna be hold that's gonna be that's gonna be holding the fridge in place. Well, it's the end of the night. Ricky and I are about to head out of here, but I wanted to give you a quick update with what we knocked out tonight. It's looking so good. It's turned out pretty cool. So we, we removed the floor covering that we had on just we didn't scratch the floor. You guys saw I put the vinyl on the front of the freezer. Ricky got the mount for the freezer put in and the baseboards, which look awesome. I also went ahead and took a crack at our initial merch hanger. Um, this is not the items that will be up here when we take this on the road, but just a little sneak peek of how it's gonna look. Um, we're trying to sort of get it laid out so that we can make some decisions on how we want to it actually to be displayed at events. So this is a good start. Um, we're on a roll right now. I mean, yeah, I mean, we still got much more to do. We have to do the rubber baseboard that goes all the way around. We still got to do RGB lightning. Um, I got to throw some more wires across and bring some more wire back this way. Uh, <laughs> more wires? <laughs> yes, more wires. <laughs> all right, guys. Well, thank you so much. Hopefully you enjoyed this update of our van. It's really coming along. I'm happy with the way it's turning out. Um, Ricky's really busting his ass, pulling out all the stops on this one. I'm doing my best to keep up. So uh, hopefully you guys are enjoying it. We got much more to come, so stay tuned. We'll see you in the next one.